I'm Sebastian. And I'm Jeff from the band Simple Plan. And you're watching Mosh Cam. I like to play Can't Keep My Hands Off You. It's fun, it's light, it's just running around stage and singing oh, 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 it's really easy. We've been changing the set around a little bit and we're starting with I Do Anything now. It's kind of like throwing back to, you know, the first record. Mm -hmm. Everybody's like, whoa, you know, it starts well, so I, I like doing that song. When, whenever we get to play a hometown arena in Montreal at uh, the Bell Center, just most of the time it's sold out, like 15,000 people, and that's pretty nuts for us. Like to feel the love of where we're from and how loud the kids can get, it's, that's, that's pretty much always my favorite. Yeah, we played 150,000 people in our province. Um, it was a few years back. Yeah, big outdoors festival. It was almost like, you know, a coming back home kind of uh, vibe. You know, we, we had toured like, you know, everywhere, came back home, and Years before, we had a we had a hard time selling, you know, the local club, selling out the local club, and then you're suddenly playing in front of 150,000 people. There's something just really powerful about that. It was raining. There was like, you know, s thunderstorms, and people it was, as far as the they eye stuck could around. See, that was nuts. That was insane. Beautiful. We fist each other <laughs> like this. There you go. Is that the right way to say it? I think it is. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's fist bump. Fist bump. Oh, fist bump. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Have a good show. That's it. Because I, yeah. I don't want you to fist me. I'm yeah, sorry. Uh, yeah, it's true. Yeah. That's just fucked up. Weird. We had some fun fans. Yeah, we've had some really good fan experiences <laughs> as well. Uh, when you, it's, it's, oh, actually. I, I, we just sounded very I, creepy I, there. I, you know I, that, right? Yeah, no, it sounded horrible. Um, <laughs> Actually, I think it was in Australia. I had just gotten an, uh, a new iPhone and I didn't have a case yet. I'm just like, hey, I don't have a case for my iPhone. And my seven fans brought me a case at the show. So I'm like, oh, thanks. I also don't have a scarf. And then the next day I got a scarf at the show. I'm like, ooh, how far can I take this? I'm like, my buddy would like a magnet for his fridge. And they brought him a magnet. I'm like, this is working out quite nicely for me. When you go, when you go to Japan, you always get tons of gifts and you re-gift them obviously at home and, uh, <laughs> and everybody's like, how thoughtful of you. And you're like, I've been thinking about you my whole trip. Yeah. It's, I brought you, know, you candy. I, I brought you candy. <laughs> you know what, I just learned a very good story. The brown M&Ms from Van Halen. I heard that that story is actually really true and it was meant for to check if people were actually reading the writer. So we put uh, green edamames in our writer to make sure. No, I'm just no, kidding. Yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> our writer is so boring. It's so normal. But like we recently, over the past couple of years, traded out all the cookies and pastries for like veggies and fruit. So like it's even more boring than ever right now. But it's good. We like it. We usually go for one beer that we know and one, and one local. local. Yeah, we'll say like, hey, like Corona and we're local adventurous beer. that way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We had a really, really, really fat bus driver at a point, and that guy kept on eating all the time. He didn't even fit in the, in the toilet in the bus. Like, he didn't fit in the door. He so he had to stop the bus, get outside, pee outside, and get back in. At some point, he ate so many cookies that he put himself in some kind of food coma and actually drove the bus in the ditch and almost crashed the bus, and it was just, like, pretty traumatic. And uh, we, we almost died. died. Yeah. But we survived. We're survivors. Yeah. It well, had to maybe. be special muffins or special you cookies. Think, yeah. It had to be. Because the cops came over, obviously, to investigate the crash, but they just let him off. The, the best part of it was hearing David cry like a little yeah, girl. David was like, ah! And then there was popcorn everywhere, because there was popcorn on the countertop, I guess. It was pretty traumatic. Yeah. Yeah, I couldn't sleep on a bus for, for a few weeks after that. That's actually. true, though. So this was a long, when we first started, people were saying that we were like a boy band like put together and blah, blah blah we're like wait a minute we worked really hard to put our first album together and now we're on tour like wasn't how, how can people think we're a boy band wasn't there a rumor about david and pierre being together at a point i think that was just fan fiction but maybe that's yeah, not erotic that. at all no. there's nothing sexy about that nothing sexy about that at all i was helping the rumor yeah. very much <laughs> he actually started i was feeding rumor. it myself again i don't think we're meant to say that in front of cameras <laughs> Uh, well, people express their enthusiasm in very, um, how can I say this, shirtless ways? ways? Yeah, very, 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 very topless very shirtless ways. Very shirtless ways. Nice. Those, those were always uh, good ways to express, you know, your love for a band. Yeah. Um, you know, you were talking about good fan stories. In the UK once, this guy asked me to sign his manhood um, 
I was very disgusted by the he idea. Politely declined. I politely <laughs> declined, but the guy would not stop. So I had to sign, like, holding the sharpie really far, and I had to do it. You went for it. The guy just wouldn't leave me alone. Good for it. You know, I showered like in the little fetal <laughs> position. <laughs> it was horrible. I'm sorry. I can't believe I did this. To raise the guitar to the gods oh, of... Yeah. Uh, like playing with your guitar like this? Yeah. There's, I don't know why That's we fun. do that. There's something really weird about it. It really hurts it. my back yes. when I do it, but I'm just like, I gotta do it. They want it. They really <laughs> want it.